New data shows this year in Travis County, more than 14,000 applications for property tax exemptions took longer than three months. KXN investigator Kelly Wiley reports this comes at a time when staffing challenges and increases in demand are plaguing the agency. Peggy McArthur has spent months trying to figure out her property taxes. Let's see. Three yeah, years ago, her right. husband died. So Among the tasks to do after his death, this is just a copy. Removing his name from the deed on the North Austin home where they lived for 42 years. This is who I called yesterday. When she did, she lost her homestead and senior tax exemptions. That's all thousands of dollars. I'd be losing money. It is standard for those exemptions to get dropped when a name changes on a deed. So she reapplied for them and waited. But more than six months went by and she still hadn't been granted the reduction in her property taxes. The Travis Central Appraisal District says it should approve those types of exemptions in just three months. It was causing a lot of anxiety because, you know, seniors were on fixed incomes and tax bills are, you know, I knew it was going to increase anyway and I didn't, I couldn't afford not, you know, not to get my exemptions. A spokesperson for TCAD said the agency received more exemption applications in the first six months of 2022 than it did all of 2021. And all year, the agency has been without half its customer service staff. Data obtained by KXAN shows the agency received nearly 32,000 applications this year. And nearly half of those, more than 14,000, did not get processed in a timely manner. The agency blamed user error for the delays in about 38% of those applications. Applications like MacArthur's, according to the agency. I had the receptionist look it all over. She said everything was in, in order. To every time they said they had every, because I was thinking maybe I missed something. TCAT said it still has more than 300 applications pending, but this week it added exemptions back to MacArthur's account. A spokesperson for TCAD said one way to expedite the process is to use their online portal rather than turning in paper forms or coming in in person. Reporting in Austin, Kelly Wiley, KXAN Investigates. And TCAD also told us in a statement, quote, while the deadline to file an application was May 2nd, property owners who have submitted their completed applications and included all required documentation at least 90 days in advance can expect to see those exemptions reflected in their 2022 property tax bills.